the Global Seed Vault is an insurance policy in a way. Physically, it's a facility in the far north in Svalbard. Uh, it's built inside of a mountain and there are three vault rooms very far back in there where it's permanently frozen and we're going to place a safety duplicate copy of the world's crop diversity there in order to protect it. Um, the danger is that it's being lost in other locations in seed banks, so the seed banks will provide a safety duplication copy in Svalbard. We are working very closely with Norway for uh, biodiversity protection against climate change. We have a common agenda and I think it's a great project. As I said, it's a kind of uh, frozen <laughs> garden of Eden we have here. Uh, the reserve of our planet in terms of uh, uh, biodiversity and so we are very committed to push this agenda also globally. Genetic uh, material is a basis of food production and we have responsibility for world food security. Uh, therefore, at a time when we are seeing great risks uh, because of climate change to global uh, biodiversity, uh, it is important we have somewhere in the world a possibility of duplicating all the uh, genetic uh, material that exists in different parts so that when we have any loss arising from uh, this uh, new situation, we know that we can have a backup and an insurance system. I think that it is important for us to realize that seed, uh, crop seeds are extremely important for the survival of humanity. But it's also very true that we are losing a lot of seeds throughout the world. We are also losing seeds due to the privatization by multinational corporation, uh, genetic engineering and subsequent privatization of such seeds. And therefore it is very, very important for farmers and especially in developing countries to have a place where nas their national governments can have seeds stored here, available to them and safe. <laughs>